Here we are. It is the final day of June and it has been a warm day. Granted, a little cooler than yesterday, not by much, but at least we are trending in the right direction as we are about to head into the month of July. Overall, when we're looking back over the course of June, the average high temperature has been about 106 degrees. So still above normal. You're seeing more red boxes than blue or purple, which would indicate below or average days. Yeah, we've been feeling the heat. The good news is that no, we really haven't been talking records. That's always nice. We have talked plenty of records in the past. Wasn't really the case this month. Our skies are staying nice and clear all around Riverside County. All of that activity maintaining its distance farther towards the east over Arizona. What we're really going to be uh, feeling as we head through this evening is more wind. Those winds, similar to yesterday, are beginning to strengthen at this time frame and will last with us through the evening. However, different from yesterday is those winds are going to be a little bit stronger now because we're actually beginning a bit more of a cool down. So right now, 24 mile per hour gust in Palm Springs, 23 mile per hour gust at this time in Cathedral City, 29 miles per hour currently in 29 Palms. So. Yes, the wind breezy right now, but will be strengthening as we head through the rest of this evening. Keep that in mind for whatever your outdoor plans may be. Still going to be a very enjoyable night, minus the breeze, bringing our temperatures down to about 100 degrees right around sunset. Humidity 15 to 20 percent out there. Now, throughout the rest of this evening, Skies are going to stay clear. We'll have a bit of a west breeze and we are again in that cooling trend. So tonight temperatures are going to be cooling a little bit more than what we felt this morning with an overnight low about 80 degrees. Then moving into tomorrow afternoon going to be a little cooler than what we felt out there today. A bit more seasonable for this time of year. An average high for the date is 107. So we're actually going to be closer to that mark as we head into July closing out the work week. So yes, we're dealing with a little bit of wind now. For most people, it's going to be just on the breezy side. For some, a little bit more gusty, especially if you're closer to the interstate. This is what we're looking at about 8 o'clock this evening. Now, watch what happens as we head into Friday. A very similar setup. Those winds begin to strengthen through the late afternoon hours, continue through the evening, and then even as we head into the weekend, a very consistent forecast regarding our winds every afternoon, every evening. Something to keep in mind for whatever your plans may be as we are getting ready to make our way into the holiday weekend. Again, but I'm really not tracking any winds that are going to be too disruptive for your plans. Your first alert comfort air seven day forecast shows this temperatures cooling on down nicely below normal temperatures going to be with us for this weekend and then on the 4th of July a high temperature closer to 100 degrees. The news continues after the break. You're watching News Channel 3, the desert's news leader.